Hey kids, welcome back to Bright Minds Kids. Today, we're taking a time-traveling adventure to a land filled with enormous giants, fast runners, and even tiny hunters. Can you guess where we're going? That's right, we're going back in time, to the world of dinosaurs. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Bright Minds Kids for more fun adventures. Dinosaurs were a group of reptiles that lived millions of years ago, even before humans existed. They came in all shapes and sizes. Some were tall and slow, others were small and fast. But not all dinosaurs were scary. Some ate plants, while others were meat eaters. Let's meet some of the most awesome dinosaurs. Meet the Tyrannosaurus rex, the king of the dinosaurs. With strong legs, tiny arms, and a huge mouth full of sharp teeth, the T-Rex was a fierce predator. It could grow up to 40 feet long and weigh as much as a school bus. But did you know? It may have had feathers when it was young. Look up, way up. That's the Brachiosaurus, one of the tallest dinosaurs ever discovered. It had a long neck that helped it reach the treetops for food. Even though it was huge, it was a plant eater and had a gentle nature. This dinosaur was built like a tank. Say hello to the Ankylosaurus. It had bony armor plates all over its body and a huge club-like tail to defend itself. No predator wanted to mess with this dino. It was short, wide, and super tough. Here comes the Triceratops, with its three horns and a big frill around its neck. It looked like a dino version of a rhinoceros. These horns were used to protect themselves and maybe to impress other dinos too. Triceratops was a herbivore, meaning it ate only plants. Watch out! Here comes the Velociraptor, one of the smartest and fastest hunters. It was only about the size of a turkey, but it had sharp claws and worked in teams to catch its prey. Scientists believe it had feathers, like a bird. Don't let the movies fool you. They were small, smart, and sneaky. Did dinosaurs fly or swim? Well, creatures like Pteranodon, a flying reptile, and Mosasaurus, a swimming reptile, lived at the same time as dinosaurs, but they weren't actually dinosaurs. Still, they were just as cool. Imagine a flying dino soaring above or a sea monster swimming deep below. We learn about dinosaurs from fossils, bones, footprints, and even dino poop turned to stone. Paleontologists are scientists who dig up fossils and study them to understand how dinosaurs lived. Every new discovery helps us learn more about the wild world of dinosaurs. Dinosaurs may be gone, but their story lives on in the rocks, fossils, and our imagination. If you loved learning about these amazing creatures, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Bright Minds Kids for more awesome adventures. See you next time. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.